Yeah, it has been quite tough last few months for everyone I think around the world and uh, I think uh, it's, it's quite difficult to get used to with the hub and power bubble so uh, I was in CPL then IPL and now here I think uh, it's getting a bit tougher but I think most importantly I'm very excited to be back for the BBL uh, to play for the strikers and uh, pretty excited about the game to be started you know I think we haven't seen the crowd in the last two competition we had CPL and uh, IPL but uh, I'm, I'm very excited that the fans will be here cheering for us and uh, that is something I quite missed from the last uh, eight nine months and uh, looking forward to a great season. I think I had enough practice in the IPL and I had enough games as well like 15 16 games which was pretty enough for me to, to come here and uh, do what I can so uh, I had a couple of uh, net session with the guys and uh, we, we just tried our best to get used as much we can and uh, and pretty pretty happy you know I think that's the most important this is my four year with with the strikers and uh, I got used to it each and everyone so it doesn't take too much time you know to 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 understand each and everyone and uh, I think it just takes a, a one or two days but uh, had good couple of practice we have practice today as well looking forward to that and then getting ready for the game tomorrow uh, nothing to nothing special I think just need to keep it simple for myself and uh, do what I can you know rather than then think about who is in the opposition I think it's always uh, depends on me how I bowl there and uh, which area I bowl so that's something which I mainly focus on rather than to think about the batsman who I'm bowling to so my main focus will be on how I bowl and uh, bowl according to the situation in field and uh, get batsmen in trouble uh, it's it's pretty uh, I think I'm pretty excited about playing under uh, Peter Seal. Uh, played before as a player, now as a captain. You know, looking forward to that, and uh, hopefully he does the best. Uh, and uh, looking forward to have a good, good, good time with him in the field as well. And Danny Briggs, I think we had a very good time in the Sussex. A very good guy, uh, very experienced bowler. I think to me he's one of the most. Uh, T20 experience bowler. Uh, he has done so well in the past for the Sussex and uh, over the in four day cricket, T20 and ODI. So he, he I'm really looking forward to that. And uh, it's it's always great to have someone like experience spinner in in the team. I think uh, it helps me as well to get from him what's the reactions of the wicket and how to bowl on those wickets. So I think I'm pretty excited to play with him. Since we're talking about the new guys, uh, Matt Renshaw and Ryan Gibson, um, looking forward to playing with them as well potentially. Yeah, I've played with them in the past uh, uh, in opposition side, so I think uh, it's it's a good opportunity for me as well to to play with them. They have done well against me, especially Renshaw. I think he he has done well when I'm bowling to him against uh, Brisbane Heat. So I'm I'm looking forward to that. Play with them, and uh, they are pretty cool guys, and uh, looking forward to enjoy as much as we can. And yourself, have you been working on any, got any new variations or mystery balls for the Big Bash again uh, this year? I think that's something secret that I can share with the uh, with you guys now. But uh, yeah, I will definitely try to do something different this year. But most importantly, I will be just focusing on uh, being more consistent with my line and length. And that's something which I have worked a lot uh, in, in the last seven, eight months. And uh, I try to be more consistent. So that's what, you know, maybe gave me the best result. To be honest, it was tough for, for my first year being here, playing for Big Bash. But uh, as as later on, I got used to with the wickets in, in the grounds. I think it's pretty suitable for me because I, I like it when it's bouncy in a bit of turn. So that's what I'm getting here in Australia. So yeah, at the moment, I'm pretty enjoying my bowling being here and uh, hopefully we'll continue this year as well. Just finally, Rash, there's an Afghanistan Island tour coming up. Do you know much about that? Is that confirmed or still in the works? I think it's still still in the works. We don't know what's going to be happen, but uh, hopefully, hopefully this week or next week we we, we, we get the result that what's going to happen. And uh, at the moment, uh, nobody knows what's going to happen. So just focusing on the strikers at the moment. Yeah, just focusing on do well for the strikers and uh, enjoy the BBL. And just finally, what does playing for the strikers mean to you? Obviously, fourth year now. Um, 
what does it mean to you to play for uh, It means a lot to me. I think I had the best time from the last three years being here, especially uh, playing in front of the beautiful crowd back home in Adelaide Oval, and it's one of my favorite ground as well. And uh, especially the New Year night, you know, that is that is a night which I always have in my mind, and I always want to 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 play that night. And uh, it's it's a great support from the crowd as well. And uh, we got lots of love from them, not only in the field when I when I'm outside walking everywhere in Adelaide Oval. I think. Uh, the people they loves me. Uh, they give me so much love and respect, so which I I like it, and uh, I will try my best to give the best of the performance to the fans and to have smile on their faces.